Hi, Tomto. Hi, hi, Ken. Good morning. Good morning, teacher. Yes. Okay, wait me for a minute. How are you today, Ken? I'm happy. Yeah, that's great. You're happy always. That sounds so great for a child to be happy always. You should be happy always. Because sometimes it's not good if we were not happy. Okay, we feel so bad and it's not good to feel bad always. Okay, so I will share now the screen for you. Okay, so today we're going to have the listening test first. Okay. Oh, where's teacher on here? Wait me. I lost my video. Okay, so here now, Ken, we're going to have the listening first. Okay, let us move the listening activity for today. Okay, you know already what you will do. You have to listen Ken carefully. So we have here the story. There are, okay, this is in the city. Oh, you can see a lot of people. There are the one who watch the toy shop. Okay, so there are the ones who ride bicycle and cars. Okay, please listen Ken. Please try to draw a line. Listen. Are you ready, Ken? Okay now? Yes. Okay, very good. Thank you. Part one. Look. Part one. Part one. Look at part one. Look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Hello. There are a lot of people here today. Yes, there are. Can you see Mrs. Brown? Yes. Where is she? She's riding her bicycle. Oh, yes. She rides very quickly, doesn't she? Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. One. Where's Mrs. Green? Do you know her? Yes. She's in front of the supermarket. Oh. What's she wearing? A red skirt and a red hat. Oh, yes. I can see her now. Two. Where's Paul? He's looking in the window of the toy shop with a friend. But which one is Paul? The boy who's carrying a school bag. Oh, I see him. Three. I need to find Mr. Farmer. Can you see him? Yes, I can. Where is he? He's there in his car. Which car? The small blue one. Four. Look at Tom. He's very tired today. Where is he? He's sitting outside the bank. Well, he played a lot of tennis yesterday. Yes, that's why he's sitting down now. Five. Is that Sue? Where? Walking with the two children. Oh, yes, that's Sue. But who are the children? I think they're her cousins. Now listen to part one again. <laughs> one. Where's Mrs. Green? Do you know her? Yes. She's in front of the supermarket. Oh, 
What's she wearing? A red skirt and a red hat. Oh, yes, I can see her now. Two. Where's Paul? He's looking in the window of the toy shop with a friend. But which one is Paul? The boy who's carrying a school bag. Oh, I see him. Three. I need to find Mr. Farmer. Can you see him? Yes, I can. Where is he? He's there in his car. Which car? The small blue one. Four. Look at Tom. He's very tired today. Where is he? He's sitting outside the bank. Well, he played a lot of tennis yesterday. Yes, that's why he's sitting down now. Five. Is that Sue? Where? Walking with the two children. Oh, yes, that's Sue. But who are the children? I think they're her cousins. That is the end of part one. Okay, let us check here your answers. Okay, number one. Okay, please, I will have to check this. This one, this is S. I will correct. Okay, this one. Uh, Okay, this is not and, this is all S. Okay, so I will write here S. You will read this S. Okay, so please now read it. Ken, kindly read it, Ken. Thank you, Ken. Mrs. Green. Is the lady in front of the supermarket wearing a red skirt and red and a red hat? Very good. Okay, I can hear you said. Oh, wait, me. Okay, correct. Red wearing. Can can wearing. Wearing. Yeah. Sorry, because my mouse isn't. It's not good. I keep on repeating this one because it's not good anymore. Okay, wearing. Okay, wearing. Okay. Uh, okay, next, number two. Can you please read again, number two? Oh, is the boy looking in the toy shop window carrying a school bag? Okay, Paul is the boy looking in the toy shop window carrying a school bag. Let me see. Well, okay, very good. This is Paul, the one wearing white. Okay, he's looking at the toy shop can because there is the word sale in the toy shop. So it means there will be a less price, a discount if you want to buy something there. Three, please, can. Miss Farmer is the man driving the small blue car. Okay, it's Mr. It's not Miss. Mr. Farmer, this one. Please read it, Mr. Okay? This is not Miss. Mr. Farmer, okay, driving the small blue car. Okay, next, number four. Tom is the boy sitting on the bench outside the bank. Very good. Tom is the boy. Okay, very good reading. Okay, look at that. Why do you think Mr. Tom is here? Why do you think Tom is here? Why? Tom is? Why do you think Tom is outside the bank? Why Tom? Why can? Can you guess, Ken, why Mr. Tom is here outside the bank? Why do you think so? Because? Because? Okay, why? Because maybe 
Mr. Our Tom is just waiting someone here. That is the reason, Ken, why he's here. Or maybe he cannot enter the bank yet. Okay, number five. Sue so is the girl with the two children. Sue so is the girl with two children. Okay. This is Sue. Look at Sue. Sue is the girl with two children. They are holding their hands together. Okay. Next one. Pop. Okay, please. Very good, Ken. Next one. Let's move on here. Okay, here. So let us listen about Tom Hill. You will have to write here the correct answer from the example. Okay, from the what here? Okay, so the name of this boy is Tom Hill. Okay, let us listen. Where did he live? How old he is? What is his father's name? The mother's name and what? Makes Tom hurts. Okay. Part two. Please listen. Listen and look. There is one example. Hello, Tom. Can I ask you some questions? All right. What's your family name? Hill. Can you spell that? H I L L. Thank you. Can you see the answer? Now you listen and write. One. And uh, where do you live, Tom? 15 High Street. Can you spell high, please? H I G H. Two. Now, how old are you, Tom? Ten. It was my birthday last week. You're very tall. Yes, all my family are tall. Three. Now, what's your father's name? John, like my older brother. So, there are two Johns in the family. Yes. Four. And your mother's name? It's Claire. Is that C-L-A-R-E? That's right. Five. Now, what's the matter? My neck hurts. Is it very bad? Yes, it hurts a lot. Now listen to part two again. One. And uh, where do you live, Tom? 15 High Street. Can you spell high, please? H I G H. Two. Now, how old are you, Tom? Ten. It was my birthday last week. You're very tall. Yes, all my family are tall. Three. Now, what's your father's name? John, like my older brother. So, there are two Johns in the family? Yes. Four. 
four. And your mother's name? It's Claire. Is that C L A R E? That's right. Five. Now, what's the matter? My neck hurts. Is it very bad? Yes, it hurts a lot. That is the end of part two. Okay. Okay, so here, the name of this uh, boy is Tom Hill. Okay. So he live at what street? What street then? It is 15. 15 Park High Street. And how old is Tom? How old is he? He is? He is? Okay. 12. 10 years old. Not yet 12. He's 10. What's the father's name, Ken Ken? It is? His name is? God. Correct, John. And the mother's name is Claire. Okay, again, please observe, look at here. In writing person's name, you have to start with big letter. Okay, or capital letter. J and letter C should be capital, like Tom. Okay, look at Tom. It should be in capital letter. Please don't forget that because they are proper proper noun proper noun name of person place or things it should be in big letter or capital letter okay what hurts are you sure it's a lot what is this look at what the boy what the boy is pointing the boy is pointing at his what's this his the boy point is pointing at his neck. Okay, his neck. The neck hurts a lot. Okay, so you've got three points here, Ken. Okay, let's oh. move to the next. Now, what did Jim do last week? This is, you have to be careful in answering, where did Jim go? What place did he visit last week? Okay, go. Please draw a line for this. Part three. Look at the pictures. What did Jim do last week? Listen and look. There is one example. Hello, Jim. What did you do last week? Well, on Saturday when it rained, I helped Mum. We painted my bedroom. What they wow, Michael, it looks great now, Aunt Lucy. Can you see the line from the word Saturday? Mm. On Saturday, Jim painted his bedroom. Mm. Now you listen and draw lines. One. What did you do on Friday? Um, we went shopping. It rained that day. That's right. Where did you go in the town? Only to the supermarket to buy some food. Two. What did you do on Wednesday? We drove to a lake. I went with my friend and his parents. Oh, what did you do there? We had a picnic. And did you swim there too? Yes. But it was cold. Three. I went in a boat on Thursday. No, sorry, it was Sunday. Where? At the beach. Dad and I went there in the morning. Did you enjoy that? Yes, but it was windy, so it was difficult. Thank you. 
four. And what did you do on Tuesday? Tuesday? Yes. Did you go to the beach that day too? No. I went to the new bookshop. The town was very busy. Oh. I wanted to get a present for Dad. Five. What about Monday? The weather wasn't good again that day. I went to my friend's flat. What did you do? We watched a DVD about someone who had a big sailing boat. Did you enjoy it? It was okay. Now listen to part three again. One. What did you do on Friday? Um, we went shopping. It rained that day. That's right. Where did you go in the town? Only to the supermarket to buy some food. Two. What did you do on Wednesday? We drove to a lake. I went with my friend and his parents. Oh. What did you do there? We had a picnic. And did you <laughs> swim there too? Yes, but it was cold. Three. I went in a boat on Thursday. No, sorry, it was Sunday. Where? At the beach. Dad and I went there in the morning. Did you enjoy that? Yes. But it was windy, so it was difficult. Four. And what did you do on Tuesday? Tuesday? Yes. Did you go to the beach that day too? No. I went to the new bookshop. The town was very busy. Oh. I wanted to get a present for Dad. Five. What about Monday? The weather wasn't good again that day. I went to my friend's flat. What did you do? We watched a DVD about someone who had a big sailing boat. Did you enjoy it? It was okay. That is the end of part three. Okay. Okay, let us see. So first, you have note there on Monday. Okay, but first, let us check Saturday. Okay, on Saturday, what did Jim do? Look at this. Ken, Ken, please check Saturday. What can you say on Saturday? What did Jim do on Saturday? He helped his mom. Okay, he helped his mom. Okay. So what that? He tried to paint the wall. Okay. How about on Friday? What did Jim do on Friday? Look at Jim. What did Jim supermarket? Okay, he went to the supermarket to buy something. Very good. How about on Sunday, uh, no, Wednesday? What did Jim do on Wednesday? He's in the lake. Okay, he is, uh, he is in the lake. He's swimming there very fast. He's in the lake. Very good. How about Sunday? What did Jim do on Sunday? He... Look at Sunday. He is? On Sunday, he is? What is what he is doing on Sunday? Look at the picture.
he's ride a boat. Okay, he rides a boat or he is sailing a boat. So can 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 he call this a sail? So Jim is sailing a boat on Sunday. Sailing, sail, sail. He's sailing the boat. Okay. Next, how about Tuesday? What did Jim do on Tuesday? Please try to look at the picture on Tuesday. He's go. He's go on library. Okay, he goes on the library. Why do you think? Is it library or a bookshop? Is it library or a bookshop? Do you think it's a library? Bookshop. Yeah, it's a bookshop because he will go in to buy something new and there is also a CD in the bookshop. Okay, and here, how about Monday? What did Jim do on Monday? He's quite relaxed here. Look at Jim. He's he watching TV. Very good. Where did you watch TV? He's watching a boat. Okay. He's watching a sailing boat on the TV. Where? In his? Where is Jim right now? In his? Where is this? In his? Yes. Bed? In his? bedroom he is on his bedroom Part three okay now look at this one very good and now please listen this one okay please listen we have questions here can and answer the questions by checking the correct answer okay please ready part four Look at the pictures. Listen and look. There is one example. Which is Ben's brother's car? My brother's got a new car. Oh, which one is it, Ben? That small one? No, it's a beautiful big one. Is it blue? No. His last car was blue. This one's red. Can you see the tick? Now you listen and tick the box. One. What sport does Ben's brother do? What sport does your brother do, Ben? He plays basketball every weekend. Does he like swimming or tennis? No, he doesn't. 2. Where does Ben's brother work? Where does your brother work, Ben? Here in the town. Yes, but where? In a school? No, he works in the zoo. Where's that? It's near the library. Oh, yes. Okay. okay. So, number one, what sport does Ben's brother do? It is what sports? It is basketball. Basketball. Okay. So here, Julian, please go charge the cell phone. Please go charge on your power bank. Okay. Next, where does Ben's brother? Where does Ben's brother? Where? He is in the zoo. He is in the zoo. Very good. Correct answer. Yes, correct. Part four. Okay, next. Number three, please continue. Three. How did Ben go to his grandparents' house? 
Did you see your grandparents at the weekend, Ben? Yes, we did. I was very happy. Did you go by bus? No, the bus is very slow. We flew there. Oh, did you? Yes, it's quicker than the train. Four. What can Ben give his sister for her birthday? It's my sister's birthday on Saturday. What can I give her, Daisy? Does she like dolls? No, she doesn't. What about a dress? She never wears dresses. She likes playing football with me. You can give her a ball then. Oh yes. Five. What's Ben's sister's favourite food? Do you want to come to my sister's birthday party, Daisy? Thanks. Have you got a birthday cake? Yes, but my sister doesn't like cake. What's her favourite food? Burgers. She likes bananas best. She <coughs> sometimes eats ten every day. I'm finished. Okay. So how did Ben go to his grandparents' house? How? Using train. By a, by a train. Train. Correct. Yes. No, it's not a train. Actually, he wants to go by a train, but they decided to ride on a plane. Maybe because grandparents' house is far. Okay, four. What can Ben give to his sisters for her birthday? What is that? It's a ball. It's a ball. Okay, let's see. Correct. And what is Ben's sister's favorite food? What is Ben's sister's favorite food? It is? It's banana. Banana. Okay, how about you, Ken? What is your favorite fruit? Watermelon? Yes. Okay. So how about banana? Do you like to eat banana? Yes. Okay, very good. So yeah, you get one mistake here in this activity. Okay, so here go up. Uh, what's that? Here can. Oh, you want to color or no? If you don't like, we can move on. I will let you choose. You want to color? Yes. Okay, go. With me. Okay, try to color this. I will let you try to color this activity. You listen and try to color. What do you think is asking you to color? Part five. Look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Can you see the sofa in the living room? Yes, I can see it. Well, colour it green. OK. Can you see the green sofa? This is an example. Now you listen and colour and draw. One. There's a chair in the bathroom. Can you see it? Yes, I can. I want you to colour it. What colour? Yellow. OK. A yellow chair. Two. Now... I want you to draw something. Good. What shall I draw? Can you draw a table? Where? In the bedroom. <coughs> draw a small table between the bed and the cupboard. Shall I draw it now? Yes, please. That's right. Between the bed and the cupboard.
three. Now you can colour again. Good. Can you see the cupboards in the kitchen? Yes. What colour shall I do? Colour them brown, please. Right. Four. Now you can draw something again. Good. Can you draw a cat? Yes. Where? In the bedroom. Draw a big black cat sleeping on the bed. Like my cat? Yes. Oh, that's a beautiful cat. Five. Now I want you to colour one more thing. Good. What shall I colour? The mat, please. Which one? In the living room. Can I colour it red? Yes, that's a good colour for a mat. Now listen to part five again. One. Finish. There's a chair okay. in the bathroom. Can you see it? So you color. Yes, I can. I want you to. Okay. The bathroom, the chair in the bathroom, yellow. Okay, that's yellow. Okay, another one. You color the. The cupboards in the kitchen brown. Okay, this one. This is the table and this is the color brown. Okay, you draw black cat sleeping on the bed. Oh, yeah, that's a black cat. Oh, my God, the black cat. And you color the mat in the living room red. Okay, that's very simple. Okay, break up, Ken. So, Ken, let's move on to the next. Okay, let's move on to the next activity. Oh. Okay, fun for movers, unit 11, things we eat and drink. Okay, look at this. Okay, this is the meatballs. Okay, we hear this as... Meatballs. Okay, this is my god. Meatball. Meatball. Okay, do you eat this one? Do you eat yes. meatballs in Vietnam? Do you have meatballs? You have? Oh, I love meatballs. Okay, another one. We've got here a pie. Okay. Pie, pie is so delicious. Okay, another one. We've got the milkshake. Are you are you familiar with the milkshake? It's quite nice. Milkshake. Okay, another. We've got. Okay, always. Okay. Yeah. Rice. Okay, we usually eat rice. Always we eat rice. Rice. Yeah. Okay. And this one. This is the. So oh, sorry. Okay, this is the sausage. Okay. Sausage. Okay, this one is what we call the 
Pancake. 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 We surely have the pancake. Did pancake and? Yes. Yeah. yeah, did your mom make a pancake at home? She does yes. a pancake. Okay, pancake, it's very easy to make, but sometimes it's quite hard also because you cannot form it out, but it's very easy. Next one. This one mango. is your aunt's favorite. I love mango. It. Mango. Mango. Yeah, and bean. bean. I, okay, bean. Do you know what is this? Do you eat that one? Do you eat bean? Okay. Lemonade. Lemonade. Okay, we drink lemonade nowadays because it's very hot. What's the weather in Vietnam now? In the Philippines, it's very hot then. How about in Vietnam? What's the weather in Vietnam? Today. It's hot also? Sunny? Yes. Yeah. Okay, it's sunny. In the Philippines, it's sunny too. Okay, we have here. This is your favorite can. What? Mouse, they know. Die. My mouse, makapungat. No huh? Noodle. Okay, no doll. I have to wallet on my light and it's on my me. Ako and that Okay. And we've got the soup. Okay, the soup maganghang ba? Makalangan. Soup. Okay, it's the soup. Okay, we usually drink soup here. And this is the something the battery put me. This is the sweet sweet like candies, like oh like chocolates, like gummy, they are sweets. Okay. So it's not advisable can can to eat sweet always because sometimes if you've got to eat sweet so what happened to your teeth that will damage your teeth so that's the reason we cannot uh, concentrate we damage our teeth already and we don't know about that okay next one we've got pineapple pineapple okay yeah. next we've got Lime. Lime. This is lime. Pineapple and lime. Another one is sauce. The sauce. Okay, it's red hot chili sauce. It's very hot, maybe because there's a chili in the bottle. Okay, now what are you eating in the breakfast today, Ken? Okay, I will ask you. What did you eat in the breakfast today? You eat what? I eat an ice cream. Wow, you eat ice cream in the breakfast? No, in the break. How about you? You, what did you eat in the breakfast this morning? You eat? I, I eat noodles. Noodles. Okay. So, how about apple? Did you eat apple? No, it's hot. No. Okay. You're drinking a cup of hot coffee. Who drink coffee oh. in the house? Who drink coffee in the house? It's my father. Okay. It's your father. How about your mom? Your mom drink coffee or no? No. <laughs> okay. So here, Kenkin, we have different things. We have the fruits, the meat, the drink, the peas, and the pasta. Please give me two. Two. Give me two foods for each, like fruit. Give me two fruits. Meat. Give me two meats. Vegetable. Two. Okay, go. And drink. 
Uh, do not include this one. Just don't include this one. Okay, please now two. I need two each. I'm finished. Okay, so we have here some. Okay, fruit, we can have mango and apple, correct? Yes. Meat, we can have sausage, chicken, and meatballs, correct? In drinks, we can have what we can have for drinks. We can have water. juice, milk, or lemon. I mean, lemon juice. Okay, our milkshake and water. vegetable, yeah, water, yeah, and onions, a vegetable, we can have onions, peas, and beans, okay, and pasta, we can have, these are mixed, pasta, fish, rice, everything in here, so this is mixed, okay, Ken, so these are our lesson next, okay, on Monday, Ken, await oh, me. On Tuesday, I will see you can at 8 p.m. in the morning. Okay, 8 p.m. 8 p.m. in the morning. So I will see you on Monday at 8 p.m. on the morning. Okay, Ken? Okay. Okay. So let us continue this topic on Monday. Wait me for a minute.
Let me see. Okay, so please, this one. Okay, so these are the topics. Pag prepare na. Okay, these are the top. Ah, uh, these are the different foods. So we have sauce. We have eggs. We have apple for the fruit. Okay, we have milk tea for the drinks. Okay, we have carrot. We have cheese for the mix. Okay, and we've got okay chocolates. This for the mix, and we've got. Ice cream, it's for the mix. Okay, pasta, sauce, pancake, egg, cheese, chocolate, and ice cream. This is for the mix. Okay. And we've got fish. Okay, water. Okay, you are correct because you put water here. And onions. And lemons. Okay, lemon is part of the fruit. Okay, lemon is part of the fruit. Okay, we've got milkshake, of course. Okay, what's the flavor of milkshake do you like, Ken? Yes. What milkshake do you like most? The flavor of milkshake that you like. What is it? What milkshake do you like? Or the one you like to eat? What milkshake? It is? Oh, the flavor. Chocolate? You like chocolate? Yes. Yeah. How about strawberry? Because mostly kids like strawberry. They like to eat or drink a strawberry milkshake. But I love the chocolate one. Right? We usually love the chocolate milkshake. It's very nice. Okay. Here, watermelon. Okay. This is one or everybody's like the watermelon. They like watermelon a lot. Okay. And noodles. Okay. Noodles is part of. Okay. So we've got here the pie. Okay. Pie is delicious. I love the pie. Okay. Pie is delicious. Okay. And meatballs. Okay, kiwi, it's also, kiwi is also a part of, a, it's a fruit. Kiwi is a fruit. Okay, so, Ken, Ken, I will see you on Tuesday, okay? At 8 o'clock in the morning, teacher will see you on Tuesday, 8 o'clock. And you can come on the class or like 7.55. Please get in the class 7.55 on Tuesday, okay? Okay. Okay. So I will see you 7.55 on Tuesday. Okay. So we can add five minutes more. Okay. So teacher Anne will have the uh will have another class today. And I will take lunch for five minutes and I will have another class. Okay. So what will be your what time you will eat your lunch today? You will uh, eat I eat fish. No, no, what time? You will eat lunch. 11? You will eat lunch at 11? No, 12. At 12? Wow. Who cooked the lunch? Who cooked My it? My mother. Your mother will cook the lunch. Okay. And it is fresh. You'll, which do you want you like best? Fish or meat? What do you want? Fish. You like fish. You didn't like meat? How about lemonade? Do you like? Oh, wait, wait. Do you like soda? Do you drink cola? Oh, you drink cola? Yes. You like cola? Oh, this cola in Vietnam? Yes. Oh, teacher Anne also will drink cola today. This lunch, I will drink cola because my... My food today is meat, so I need to drink cola. I love cola with ice. You love cola with ice? Yes. Oh, how it's spaghetti? You like spaghetti? Yes. Oh, again, always. Always, yes, teacher. I always love spaghetti, pasta, what else? Burger, you like that? Pizza. 
Oh, you like pizza? You like? You yeah. like pizza? Wow, you like pizza a lot. Okay. So, Ken, Ken, I will see you on Tuesday. What time on Tuesday? 7 55. Okay. Thank you. Bye bye, Ken. See you on Bye. Tuesday.